Well, hi, and welcome to 2023 and Sands Kia right here. We're out here with Wally's Weekend Drive right here, joined by Tyler Smoot right here. Tyler, I'll tell you, we're looking at the 2023 Telluride right here. Kia has really hit the mark here. You know, have you had a chance to drive one yet? I have. They're really fun to drive. A lot of fun to drive. Let's go ahead and take a quick look here. One thing that you're going to notice right here, this has a big long name. So it's the SSX Prestige X-Line V6 all-wheel drive. First thing you're going to notice, the, uh, the SX features on it, blacks everything out. So when you see the grill uh, right here, goes around to the trim, goes around all the way to these 20 inch wheels right here. Beautiful 20 inch powder coated wheels that as you're riding down the road is getting an air curtain right here from the wind that keeps going around because this large of a vehicle that is all wheel drive isn't going to get the best mileage that's for sure but it's not going to make that much difference because they've done such a good job with it. The side mirrors right here you see do have the blind spot warning on there but also inside what you have is when you turn the blinkers on if you turn your left signal on you will see the left gauge turn into a, a camera or you know basically a display so you'll be looking right down the left side if you use your right blinker you see right down the right side of the vehicle so from a motorcycle rider standpoint this is probably the best feature in the world for us that are out there riding now also Tyler I look inside here I see a couple things first thing I see is that brown Napa leather yeah, that new brown Napa leather is amazing in these Tellurides. Super comfortable for your long road trips, as well as they are heated and cooling in these seats now. Okay, so you're talking about comfort. One thing that they added this year is the lateral thigh support, the front of the driver's seat that extends out to the back of your knees. So when you go on those long drives, the support that you get on your legs is the difference between an old guy like myself being able to get out and jump around and get gas or whatever you need when you stop or getting out and having to unwind and creak and everything to get going so that's a big thing here also we have the heated and, and ventilated the, the seat heaters in this I know we're in Arizona and people like to laugh at it but the seat heaters work really really well as well as the steering wheel heater yes they do they actually heat up rather quickly and get very warm so you never have to worry about those getting in that cold leather seats during the winter time as well as you know in the displays for the heated steering wheel it works great and heats up very quick for that as well yes in fact i almost <clears throat> toasted my buns the other day with the seat so you do have to turn it down uh, the high version would probably be more for some place up north that's like a negative 30 or negative 40. Uh, down here the medium setting was just fine for me uh, but also let's take a look in the back here maddie uh, because one of the things that I like to point out to people, USB-C plug-ins there in the sides of the seat for the people in the back. So Kia definitely is taking care of the second and the third row back there behind it. There is a third row. And also, if you look down underneath, you will see that there is a 115 volt outlet down there, uh, like a cigarette lighter type and a regular plug-in too. So that really turns out to be cool. And when we walk around to the back here, what we'll get, one thing that you'll see, like I said, it does have three row seating. I don't have the third row up right now. We got it down. We do have the cargo cover here. So if you're dr driving down the road, you've got luggage in the back and you don't want everybody else to see what's back there, this right here covers it all up. And you can see right there, there are the seats right there. And underneath the third row here, if we can get this up, you will see that you have storage in here also and there is a spare tire you open this up and you crank it down and it comes down underneath so it doesn't leave you on the side of the road waiting for AAA for six hours like I had to do this weekend um, but you know, all those things kind of, kind of come around now Sands Kia out here in Waddell you guys are located off the 303 in Waddell I see a lot of inventory. You guys been getting your inventory back up to par? We have, yeah. We have more trucks coming in every day. Our inventory is doubling by the week. So we definitely have plenty available on the lot. Even the ones that were hard to get before, we have those sitting here waiting for someone to come pick them out. There you go, right there. So Sands Kia off the Waddell and the 303. Come on out here and take a look at this Telluride because the MSRP on it is only $54,120. And when I say only, go check out a Tahoe or go check out an Escalade and see what they cost. 